I've got um, over there software update this morning on uh, my Samsung Galaxy S3 4G here in Sweden. I had 4.1.1 earlier out of the box, so it's already running Jelly Bean. So with this update, um, I thought I should get 4.1.2, but after all the updates was made it still says 4.1.1 and that is really strange because now I have the new keyboard uh, although uh, the Samsung version of it so I can swipe when typing and I have uh, the new Gmail now so I can um, for example swipe with my fingers to delete emails and uh, automatic zooming of text and so on. So I have a new Android version, but it still says 4.1.1. Why? Has Samsung forget to change the number to 4.1.2? Or what happened? Nothing got wrong, everything was just fine. All the updates was made perfectly and I saw the cool uh, Android update logo while updating and so on so I don't get it why it still says 4.1.1 I don't get it but uh, great that I got all these updates I have waited for them especially the new Gmail because I use Gmail a lot so this will be much better for me the new keyboard I haven't tried it so much yet but um, I think it's not as good as swipe, but we will see. Uh, as I said, it's uh, the Samsung version of the Android vanilla keyboard, swipe keyboard. If it's not as good as uh, swipe, I will still continue using swipe. I will try it today. I will use it today to see uh, how good it is. So, I got the... Uh software update on my Samsung Galaxy S3 4G this morning uh, over the air a new firmware this uh, version of the Samsung Galaxy S3 uh, had 4.1.1 out of the box so it's already running on Jelly Bean but um, this after this update I still have the same version number 4.1.1 but I have the new keyboard, new Gmail and all that. So very strange that I don't have a new version number. So let's start with look at the version number. And as you can see here still have Android 4.1.1 I don't know if this could be some details about the new version or not I don't know but I think it's very strange that I got a real software OTA update with the cool Android animation while updating the firmware and all that but still have the same version number as before but I have the new Gmail and all that I can swipe to delete and so on as you can see here and uh, I have the new keyboard can do an email here. As you can see it down here, it's the standard Samsung stock keyboard, but now I can swipe to type. And uh, I can use the Swedish keyboard while swiping too. Now I have the Swedish um, 
So I can use swipe even with a Swedish keyboard now. I couldn't with the leaked version that I installed before. The Jelly Bean stock keyboard with swipe feature. I couldn't use Swedish in that, but in this new Samsung keyboard I can swipe with Swedish too. So I think it's strange. I have the new keyboard, I have the new Gmail, and it, it did a, a complete firmware update with the Android animation and all that. Uh, I had to add it to the charger before update and all that. I still have the same version number. I don't get it. Very strange. So what's going on? I don't know. Can someone tell me why this happened? And I can also say that um, it, the phone has crashed. Some um, system services and so on has crashed sometimes now after the update and I don't like that. It seems that this version is more buggy than the older version, but still the same version number. Okay, bye.